Hello, welcome back to Foundation. We had a, a bit of an update to the game. Not really much of an update to the game per se, but just an update on the release date of this one. Uh, it, before, it was supposed to be hitting Steam Early Access in the end of, uh, of this year, but they bumped it back to quarter one 2019 before it hit Steam Early Access. A lot of folks have been asking me uh, if, the, you know, they wish they could play the game. It's not out yet and all that, but you can actually get the game. You can play this version. If you go to the uh, their website, uh, Polymorph Games, I'll put a link, uh, and you can you can uh, buy it through their site and play the game now. Uh, but if you're waiting for Steam, it's going to be a little longer, anyway. Uh, so I've been playing for just a little bit here before we got started recording, and and I had to do some damage control. We were down to minus to 47, 46 happiness. We did hit 100 people in town. Uh, I haven't done much else other than I built an extra bakery, I built a bunch of wells everywhere, and I got a couple more markets going. Gonna mark it over here, hoping that people people would just eat. Uh, we have a problem with folks uh, having whining about not having enough food, and uh, that, yeah, that that's that's the issue basically. Uh, so we got folks working all these stands, which uh, are should be selling the food. So it still says nothing sold this week on all these. Uh, this one has a bunch getting sold in here, but. Um, much more wells, much more food, trying to keep our stock our stockpiles up. We have a big problem with bread. We're just not getting enough bread made. Uh, even though we have a ton of, uh, of grain, flour. I'm on the 59 actually right now. Uh, but that uh, should try to get everything under control and get our happiness back up there. When I started, I was playing maybe 15 minutes or so. I was up like, a seven, like 70 happiness and it just plummeted uh, when we hit 100 people. So hopefully folks will go back and start, you know, not whining. Um, people are just walking on, you know, as we do, we just walk out there. <laughs> we don't use boats. <laughs> See, like, they're complaining. Like, he doesn't have any water. That's what he's complaining about. No water, he doesn't have any goods either, which, yeah, goods is a problem, too. Uh, one, one, one step at a time here. Um, you don't have anything. But there's things everywhere. I have, I have markets everywhere. I have wells everywhere. I think maybe we need to, like, focus on the paths. Like, let's put a market in... Right here. Just a food market. I'm going to set it right here at the edge because this is where people are walking. So I'm hoping that this will encourage them to actually eat things when that's there. I'll put a well over here too. It's going cost me money. But I think that's the kind of the problem is they're running around and not stopping off at all these places. I have a ton of these. Nothing sold per week. No one's going there to buy anything. But they're all whining about not having any food. So it's clearly an issue. 36 bread now. It's actually gone up. Pretty good. Some of the folks were whining about not having any place to put a house either, which doesn't make any sense either. Um, I guess people don't really want to live in some places. This is growing over here. Um, this is kind of growing. We can't grow back there, but we can go over here outside the wall, I guess. Um, and I expanded this a little bit more. So there's one house going in over there. Uh, I think if, when we do get to the point of expanding more, I'm going to go build over here and put like a little farmland spot around here, like with sheep and, and, and grain and try to make some, get like a clothing industry going over that way is the plan. Um, I also put a warehouse in that only takes in food with, in, with hopes that it would help the supply of food go out a little better. And uh, it's gone up quite a bit. It's still, look at that. Look at that. It's minus 172. I lacked something recently. I'm guessing it's clothing. They're lacking. Uh, you want some cotton? I have a ton of cotton, so sure, I will do that. And uh, that'll give me that one. Which way do we got all these? So these aren't really matter any. Uh, once we get that weekly profit up there, though, we can actually finally get this quest done. <laughs> I don't know if there's any quests after that. We'll never find. We'll never find out. All right. Up to two clothing. Oh, they're gone. As soon as we get clothing, they're gone. And. I did make another weaver. We got him over here. Uh, female and Rupert are making are making those, so that should help our clothing stock a bit. Uh, very slowly. And bread bread gets up there in the you know tens or so, and it, it plummets back down as well. So we're um, doing what we can here. We're down to actually 23 flowers. So these windmills are actually not working fast enough now. So the grain we got plenty of grains, not not enough windmill. So. I'm hesitant to keep building things because uh, it costs so much money to make them initially. We're almost up to our... Uh, how's my budget looking? 
Um, oh, we're doing pretty good. Village consumption or um, income thirteen twenty one, and expenses only eleven sixty six. So yeah, that, that's pretty good. Just general spending. Um, I did get the blacksmith done. Uh, I started building it over here. If it did finally get done, so we're making tools. And they're flying in. We've made a bunch of them. Um, we have thirty nine now. I I have them set to sell, but I don't think they will sell because nobody nobody wants them. Nobody's buying tools. They're buying planks and uh, stone and, and berries. You're buying clothing and cotton, which I do have cotton. I can sell you that. If not, um, there's another warehouse that maybe that has it. Let's go look over here. I, that's one thing that probably could help out a lot of things. Also, is is managing my my warehouses a little better. Like you have 200 of this iron. But you can't carry anything else because that's all you have. What am I going to do with all this stuff? I'll be able to upgrade you. Empty that stock out. And I want you to carry... In this one over here, you are like the clothing thing. So I want you to take clothing in and cotton and... Not, I keep calling it cotton. By the way, sheep produce wool, not cotton. Just in case you're curious. <laughs> um, I will, you take flour in also. And, uh, I mean, if you want, uh, yes, yeah, sure, take that, too. No, no, don't take, don't take the planks. I don't want the planks. Refuse the planks. So hopefully that will maybe help out. Well, that's, because there's, there's, there's people running these things. They will help move the things around, I'm hoping. Uh, let's see how everyone's doing. Hey, uh, you. Who are you? Female, 1218. You don't have any food. You don't have any water. You are whining about things, but you're walked just right by a well. You walk by a food spot. Nope, you got food. Okay. You got food. Oh, you're good now. You're good now. Okay. Oh, look, we did it. Oh, come right down. We had it. We had it. We made it up to 103 people. We, uh, we have 36 bread in stock. Unbelievable. I, I cannot believe it. Um, okay. It's amazing what happens whenever we actually start making things. We're actually running out of flour, though. We gotta get a windmill now. Uh, windmill, 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 it doesn't go. Oh, I got 200 bucks for this. Uh, we're gonna put it over here, because this is where everything is. Our, is ooh. Yeah, right there. Okay. That'll get made eventually, and we'll get more bread. Bread's our, our crop. We can't find any more berry farms anywhere. Probably some nearby somewhere, but we can't seem to grab them. Um, but yeah, my next town's gonna be, it, it's just gonna be cool. We're going for the cool factor here. We're gonna put it over this way. And build a farmland spot over here. Farmland, uh, some sheep, windmill, you know, all that stuff. Uh, maybe maybe some clothing can get made over there too. You know, just be cool. All right, the two towns are going pretty good though. We got a couple of houses popping in here. I put the well in to get to encourage more houses to pop up. Seems to be working. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. Somewhat. People don't really want to live over here too much. And I can I can move maybe another market around here that make them a little bit happier. But, um, our resources are looking good. I got 50 tools now. Um, we're up to how much bread? Eight bread. A whole eight, six, four, twelve. Bouncing around one shirt. So, yeah, it's all right. I also moved my coal thing that I had over here back into this town. This seems like this is just industry industry land over here, so it, it should be, you know, have industry things. And they're, uh, they're making me some tools there. We got these guys working. We got this stock house is taking all this stuff in, but it's just, um, it's full of, 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 uh, iron. And I don't know if, am I trading iron? Yeah, above 30, but, but no one's actually selling it. So. So we're just hanging on to it. I mean, we could probably, we could, ooh, you gonna be okay there, buddy? Um, we could probably, like, stop production on the iron. Just destroy the building and to keep the money, you know? And we probably would be fine. Are you looking over here? Are you looking alright? You have nothing. Now let's see if you actually get stocked up on things once you walk by it. I put all this stuff, like, on the way. But they don't seem to care. It seems, maybe it has to do more to do with if it's near their house than anything else. I need to fill my needs. What if I put a market, like, back here or somewhere? Where all these houses are? I just have so many markets around. I'm paying... Uh, actually, I'm not paying anything for these, actually. It's using villager spots, but I can put markets all throughout the town. I already have. 
Iron, yes, I will gladly give you iron. I'll give you all my iron. You can have more. There you go. Okay, so. House is upgrading, good. 52 happiness is not the greatest. People are still pretty cranky. And I think it's clothing that they're whining about. Um, we are we are weaving that clothing as much as we can. Rupert's doing the best he can. Uh, we got Rupert, and we also have uh, female 436 cranking out the shirts as much as they can. We can we can make more of those too. We probably should. Uh, let me build that. I mean, they do buy it, so it, we make we actually make money by having these these uh, these tailors around. Let's make another one. Let's just throw it in. I don't know, like right over. Try to keep like the main businesses in the middle here, but we've got so packed so big spread out can't really do that anymore more clothing we could probably use it even in another one um let's put one over well it makes sense to have it over here it's all the the fabric is over this way i think it makes sense more sense to just have it on the side of town okay there he's done already okay getting their uh mail 798 we gotta upgrade their name list also Certainly, they should be able to have more than a hundred names. What if I can? What if I can edit the name list? Oh, check that out. I'll certainly check that out. Down to Fifty with people whining about not having things. Uh, how you doing over here, buddy? You. Okay, fill my needs. See, this is one I, that I'm concerned about, and I don't understand why. You want lodging? You don't have a house. Why not? We have lots of builders in town, correct? Uh, yeah, we got tons of builders. I'll make more builders. So, you should be able to go and build lots of things. You should be able to go build your house. Having a lack of housing should not be an issue. I think this might be a bit of an, a problem having this long path because people get hungry on the way there and they, then they don't eat. And they're trying to walk this whole way carrying resources. So this actually might be a bit of an issue with the way the game's set up at the moment. Uh, we don't need any more coal, so I don't I don't need you working in there. In fact, I'm tempted to just fire all of you. Uh, what is that? Iron? We have 296 sieve. Um, it's not you. It's... Where's that? You. So don't, don't work here anymore. In fact... Oh, we did it! What? We did it! Lord Manor. Oh, somebody keeps mentioning. Uh, I keep forgetting. Uh, something about the Lord Manor here. Edit. One of the things we put on this thing was the door, I think it was. And the door had, like, red on it or something, so maybe that was causing a problem. Over here. See this red notch? Is that making things not work? I can't do anything with it now, though. I can, just, I can destroy the whole thing. But yeah, why does it say I not have a, don't have a Lord Manor? We built the tax office, right? I think, I think we did. Yeah, this is one over here. Um, building complete Lord Manor. So I'm not sure about that. Just another doorway there. It does have a red thing there, which... I don't know what that means. It says no one works here either. No workers assigned. How do we get to do that? I want people working in here. Villager capacity 7. Um, we have a core. We can make another core, I guess. Build that. And we'll do a uh, another extension. Do we have an extension? I don't know if I do. That. Uh, put a chimney on it. There we go. Um, we have a stone core. I know we do. Stone door. Sure. Right there. Uh, it's red. Why is that one red always? Mm. Can't tell if it's red or not. <laughs> not what's over there. Uh, 
Um. It's red. Just build it. Hope that works. Does something for us. So, they'll go build it. Um. Can I build another one, actually? What if, what if we do that? What if we say I want to build another Lord Manor? Yeah, build another one. You have at least three structures to it. We'll put one over here on this side of town. Um, I want a core. The ground is very hilly, so we can't do much to it. We need a door. And we need a, uh, a tower. Like that. Okay. That's it, right? All done? Um, and a chimney. Nope. Nope. Um, done. Oh, that was it. You want some berries? I ain't giving you my berries. No. Okay, that was it. Um, now, if I add in something like a treasury... Expand the treasury capacity to your coffers. So it gives me the ability to hold more money. Right? That's what that one does. A bailiff and a tax. Let's put another tax office in. It's like the entire building. It's just, it's just a tax building. Okay? Yeah? Um, sure. Now, will that increase... We'll see what that increases. Maybe that gives me more money? Right? Because that's one of the things we get here is, is in our budget is, is um, taxes. Territory taxes. Um, is a village income. Maybe. It's going to work on right now. I think this will also increase the uh, the desire to live around here. This will increase, yeah. A bunch of green will be popping up in here. Some people will start building houses around here. So we will... Uh, still, I don't have the ability to put... It doesn't give me that thing like it did over here. Because over here, I have the thing where it says... Workers. Build your capacity. Interesting. This one doesn't say it. People are whining again about about life. Um, how about a stone core? Whoops, Windows button. There we go. Okay, yeah, make that. Okay. Looking good, looking good. All right. Um, now, still don't have any money. Still super mad. Everyone's furious. We have clothing. We are out of bread now. Uh, we out of. We are out of. Uh, oh, we're out of fabric. We're out of flour. We have tons of grain. We need the windmills to be working. I didn't think I put anyone in here. Get to grain, Megan. Finally got uh, bread under control, and then we ran out of grain. Yeah, flour's not the problem. It's, it's, uh, it's the... Uh, f our, our grain's not the problem. Flour's the problem. Okay, it's working now, though, so it should be cranking in some uh, some flour. Right, we got to ten now. Let's give us some bread. Uh, I'm tempted to put another bakery back here, but I think we need more windmills before we can do that. And we might put another farm in here. I think we've got everything built that we that we can. Yeah, right. Yeah, everything's everything's done. There was, I think, there was might have been an update, but I didn't see anything new about it. Maybe put a fence over here. You know, just because. Maybe we need something over. We need something pretty over here. So let's let's do some fancy stuff. If you're walking along here and and you decide to stop off at the church, sir. Got a market over here they can stop off at, which they they don't. I wish there was different kinds of fence. Lord Manor is now complete. Does this cost me, does this cost me money? How much is this costing me? Five gold and one tool and one plank for each fence. Okay, no more than that, I guess. Uh, okay, so you're complete. Still, oh, it does have a villager capacity now. A five. What's that mean? 
Can I tell somebody to go and work there? No. Okay. I heard some, uh, some bells. That was you, right? We'll put our fence... We'll eventually get it going around this way, too. Everyone's just skirting along the edge here. That's fine, that's fine. You can walk that way if you want. Uh, how's the bread look? We got eight bread. We got three shirts. Uh, 44 unhappiness still. We'll turn immigration off if we don't want people, but no, we want people. We want lots of people. We're just waiting for cash to come in. And we're up to how much? Mm, we're making a little bit. Where's my expenses? We're paying 112 gold on wells. 140 on the church. And we're gaining 816 from all the bread we're making. That's a lot of money from wells. And I think it's... I don't know that it's necessary. I wish there was a way of seeing if they were using it or not. But I don't really know. Um, I'm tempted to maybe get rid of a few. Look, we have tons of wells around here. I would just I, I went and I spammed them, went crazy with them, trying to get people to stop whining. It didn't work. But water isn't really the problem. Some of them were complaining about water. Um, see, he's complaining about housing. Which we should have plenty of room for. We can put a spot around here. People want to live by that church. This didn't actually do me any good. I thought it would. Um... We could build a, uh, a a church over here, a little rustic church. Make it a dark theme. Is that what that one is? I don't remember what that one is. Maybe that one. Maybe that one is dark. Uh, yeah, I'll give you all that. I have plenty of that stuff. Um, we'll like it. Look, make it look like it's attached to this little house. That thing, and we'll put a unnamed part on the front. Like that. Um, tower on the side. And then a... Um, nope. Small little extension. Nope. Um, sure, just a door like that. Yeah. That's perfect. Build that thing. There we go. Okay. I really enjoy just the sort of the sandbox part of this game. Just building things, you know, and just sort of letting things go. But uh, I'm having issues with the happiness. I don't really know what to do about it. I mean, we have we have a ton of food. Clothing is, is an issue. And I think that's one of the big problems. It doesn't... Let's see here. What are you whining about? Trader, not you. You. So he's, he's whining about everything but a house. There's no reason for anyone to complain about water. And that's the guy that just left us that way. <laughs> um, so yeah, well, oh well. People are cruising out of here like, get out of here. This town's the worst. Yeah, if, if I could expand to a place that has berries, I probably should do that. Like there's, no, that's, that's iron. But there are no berries on the map anymore. There's some, oh wait, there's some right there. Can I expand it there? I could. I could just grow my town. It's a small upgrade, but that's big. That's big news. Having more berries. Anything else? There's berries over there. Um, I'm not seeing any at a glance. There might be some, I guess, in the trees there. I don't see anything. Um... Except for this one. Or this one right here. Actually, that might be okay. Right there next to us. We can eventually get this whole island connected because we people want to live here, right? This is this is green spots. Well, it will be. Once it grows a little more. Church is done. This one. Oh yeah, okay. I can this is this is the dark one. This is the light one. Cool. Just like that. I think I can actually set it up. 
<laughs> yeah, <laughs> we made the chime. Variability average, average. You are, you don't have any food, but there is a food shop right here for you to grab food. Plenty of bread to grab. It has 14 food in it. Um, I need another, uh, another fabric maker guy. Let's make one. A, uh, tailor. Right? No, not a tailor. A, um, weaver. 200 bucks for that, but we're going to put him over here next to this next sheep farm. And we'll grow over this way, I think, to get the berries. Even though I really want to get that, uh, that farm going. Farmland spot. Okay, there we go. That'll give us more cloth. Get more shirts. We may put a, a shirt person over here, Taylor, as soon as uh, this gets built, as soon as we have the cash. There you go. Good work, buddy. And we're actually almost out of coal. Which we don't need anymore. Um, I'm really I'm really tempted to, to uh, shut down the iron mine. Why don't we just delete it? How much am I paying for this thing? Five bucks? Okay. Yeah, you're done. And I no longer... I do need coal. We'll keep the coal going. Mary's making that. Um, you are turning it into iron bars, which, again, I have a ton of and don't need anymore. So, you're gone, too. Just to save a little bit of cash. I wish I could, wait, I could just, like, shut it down. That'd be noisy over here. Um, without completely dismantling it. Dismantling it. But we can go back over there and make it later. Keep these people working. Fishermen seem to be the crankiest people. They always are the ones that have to replace. But look at them. They're walking in the water. It's another job that we can easily deal with. Just putting a whole bunch of fish out there. You know what? Let's do that. Uh, more fish. How much do these cost to make? Just five wood? Let's just line the shore with fish. Or men. Okay. Those are the docks. Now, that's five more fishermen. Five or six. I think I did five there. Um, we can put a market in, I guess, to sell the fish if we need to, but we shouldn't need to. Yeah, make some docks. How do I erase these? No. Uh, sure. Okay. Um, I mean, if this works out well, maybe we just make fish our thing. We just sell fish everywhere. Um, we can probably adjust it already over, like, over here. Uh, no one's working here. May, uh, sell fish. I'm curious. Uh, where's why? Here, you. What if I say this? Sell faith. What does that do? What is, kingdom points is what you're selling. What does that mean? I don't know, but do it. Okay, so the fish should come screaming in here. We're all going in the same spot to fish. It's fine. It's fine. We like it. It's a good spot. We work there. We, we get fish. We are out of this are you built yet yeah make me some cloth uh, as soon as you're done we'll put in maybe another tailor over here which I think we should do so we went down to 33 happiness everyone's so mad they're so mad what are you mad about you don't have a house no excuse you don't have water there's no excuse for that either uh, let's see here part of this is probably I mean this game is very early development so I'm sure that's that's a bit bit of it. I don't usually play the um, game is uh, is having issues card, but I think that probably applies a little bit <laughs> a little bit here. Uh, let's see, plenty of spots for. Fun. I'm surprised only wants to live over here. You know what? We got my manor is over here. There's a church over here now. Come live over here. 
41 happiness. That's pretty bad. Now, what we could do is probably put in a market over here that just holds fish. And that way all the market, not market, but a warehouse that holds fish. But she, see, now she's hauling it. You can see him hauling the box. Where's it going? Into here. This one's holding the fish. It seems like a lot of walk. A lot of walking to do. So we have a warehouse over here. Which is fully stocked of stone. So refuse that. Get get it out of here. I want you taking in fish. Right, you're right next to the fish place. Just run over there, dump it off. Done. We'll probably squeeze one in right in here and it'd be even better. Fifty bucks to make this thing. There we go. You are going to be fish land. We actually have five clothing. It's still going down. Uh, bread's getting eaten uh, kind of fast. Fish should be growing, so let's switch uh, you out to be... You are the fish, okay. But nothing is sold. Why is nothing sold? People should be buying it. One sold. Yeah, that's something. All right, I think we got to call it a day here. Thanks again for watching. Uh, we may It may be a little while before we do another episode. Uh, I'm going to hold off, and maybe next time we get an update or something, uh, then, we'll, then we'll do it another update, uh, another video. I don't know. We'll see how long I can hold off playing this game. I do enjoy it. It's nice. Uh, so for uh, days when I uh, when I just don't really feel like playing anything, this is a, this is the perfect game to come in and sort of dink around with and and uh, make my town. I wish it was a little more casual and not so uh, frantic all the time. <laughs> Sometimes. Uh, no, no, refuse everything. I want this to be fish land. Just take fish in. Zero fish. People are eating. People are fatties. Anyway, thank you for watching. And uh, if I can find that name file, I will. I will add to it. But I'll see you next time.